What up homies, before we get into the skit, this video is sponsored by my favorite sponsor, Manscaped. The number one brand that helps men become the fucking man. Now when it comes to body hair maintenance, Manscaped does it best. You may prefer a trim instead of a shave, or a shave instead of a trim or anything in between. It doesn't matter because Manscaped has created the ultimate package for your package and everything else. Introducing the Platinum Package 4.0 by Manscaped. A full body luxury grooming and hygiene kit designed to help you look and feel your best and give you that BGE, big grooming energy. Gotta get that BGE to give that BDE, if you know what I'm saying. This is the perfect kit to get you started if you went scaping already. If you went scaping already, then what are you waiting for? Go to manscaped.com right now and use my code Jimmy20 at checkout and get yourself 20% off plus free international shipping and two free gifts. Let's go. Thanks to the legends at Manscaped once again for sponsoring this video. Now to the skit. What up homies? Today, I'm gonna teach you how to do a bomb. Like bad. Yeah, yeah. And not just one bomb either. I'm gonna teach you how to do all the bombs that I can do. Why do you wanna learn a bomb? Cause we're going at the summer here in New Zealand the land of the bomb kings. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, far, Aussie's actually pretty good, eh? Aussie's getting up there, man. I see some mean Aussie boys do some mean manus. Some mean tucks. That's actually a manu saying, I think you should say young tuck. So yeah, that's why you want to um, know how to do a bomb. Especially in New Zealand, coming in the summer, everybody be bombing. And if you don't know how to bomb, it's going to be embarrassing. You don't want to be that guy. And that's why I'm here today, homies. And that's why you clicked on this video. Because this summer, you're going to be doing the Mecca bombs. Let's go. That was pretty good, eh? Yeah, that was pretty good, bro. That was pretty good, eh? You reckon yeah. we should get in the water? Oh, I reckon you should just, just hurry, the there, hurry the fuck up, Hurry the fuck up, eh? Yeah, bro. Chewbacca is going to be making an appearance in this video. Yeah, you're fucking here, he is. <laughs> I told you Chewbacca was making an appearance. You're skinny for later. Hopefully you can do a fat bomb. Yeah, there's a few things that, uh, that can help your bomb be a lot better. One, jumping from a good height. Two, uh, weight. If you have weight, which unfortunately I do not, that will help your bomb be a lot bigger, obviously. Technique, which is the last option, which is probably the most important. So yeah, there's height, weight, and technique. So our bombing order is gonna go from the weakest to the strongest. The first bomb we're doing is gonna be the can opener. Probably the easiest bomb to do. What the fuck is that? A can opener. Yeah. You know, when you, the knee bomb. Oh. So we're gonna start off with the can opener. All you gotta do is pretty much you jump in the water like this. And as soon as this leg here touches the water, you're gonna lean back. And that's how you do a can opener. I'll show you. Take my shoes and walk a mile, so that you can. Oh, what's that, dub? That was mean. The next bomb we're gonna do is um just a normal bomb. Now for this one, you need height. As I'm pretty much just gonna jump in the water, just with a little bend in my knees, like this. And as soon as my feet touch the water, I'm gonna lean back. Pretty much like the most basic bomb, the normal bomb. Probably gonna get age restricted because of this Chewbacca chest, eh? Spider-Man bomb! Nah, I'm joking. Just a quick Now next bomb is the staple. Now this is the main one. All bombs from here and up are very, very respected. For a staple, it's pretty obvious. Pretty much gonna jump in the pool like a staple. And then as soon as your hands and feet touch the water, you wanna spread out. Don't do it too early though, or you're gonna slap your chest. You might get wet. Now be sweet, bro. Was that all right? All good? Yeah, I just got wet. You might get wet. Now be sweet, bro. Yeah, all Sorry. good. Now all good, but not. Yeah, all good. Are you all wet? Bloody hell. I know. We're at our last bomb, which is the Manu. The most famous bomb. Can you do roll bombs there? Roll bombs? Yeah. What's that? We. You... you can show me a roll bomb out. Oh, I can't do them. Is that when you like... Are you mean a gorilla? Where you roll into it. Yeah, 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 it's a gorilla. Nah, I can't do the gorillas, bro. I've tried to master it. I think I'm too skinny. So yeah, we're going to do a Manu now. It is the hardest bomb to learn, or one of the hardest bombs to learn. There's two ways to do a Manu. You want to jump into the water in a V shape, like so your legs up, arms up. That's a tuck, you know, you're kind of tucking in while your legs are up. And then when your bum hits the water, you want to expand out. That technique does not work for me. So what I do is I actually come in like this, kind of a V shape, but I'm bending my legs. As soon as my bum touches the water, I'm going to go bang and kick out. I'm pretty sure those are all the bombs that I can do. So we did the can opener, the basic bomb, the normal bomb, the staple, and then the manu. But what it really comes down to is learning all the bombs you can, mastering your technique, and then you just create your own style. And then yeah, you're gonna be the fucking man every summer. Shot for watching. Cha-cha. Looking at the 18th, 
so eagles, fuck tryna party. I need to run up G's till I'm eight feet buried up underneath of the garden.